Rebecca Fiorentino here, your guest reporter for the ACC Digital Network, and I'm honored to be with Commissioner John Swafford. Commissioner, you won an ACC championship back when you were a student athlete at UNC. What are some of your fondest memories from that year? Well, I think playing with a great player like Don McCauley and, and a terrific quarterback like Paul Miller and an outstanding kicker and Ken Craven and just a lot of other terrific players. I, th I think the thing that over the years you appreciate the most are the people that you played with, your teammates, and uh, you develop a lot of lifelong friendships through that. Now, you were a student athlete, of course, and then you were an athletic director and now a commissioner. How have you kind of seen the ACC evolve through the years? Well, numbers-wise, it's changed a great deal. I, I've seen the league when we've been uh, 7, 8, 9, uh, 11, 12, uh, and now 15. So, you know, purely from that standpoint, I've, I've seen a great deal of change. The beauty of all that during the last decade or so is I think our league has come through all of the changes in college athletics stronger than we've ever been before. And I, I'm very proud of our institutions in regard to that. We've got a great group of, uh, of 15 schools, 14 in football. Uh, that's uh, just terrific in terms of their programs, the quality of the institutions, and the people who run them. Now we're here for a reason, the ACC football championship. As a sports fan, how excited are you to see the matchup? Well, it's a great matchup. I think it's the best matchup in the country in terms of championship games. The number one team in the nation uh, playing a, uh, a team that is top 10 ranked and, and has won 11 straight games. So I don't think you can beat the matchup in terms of the, the quality seasons that these two teams have had. Great fan bases at both institutions that will pack the stadium. Uh, a lot on the line in terms of the playoff situation. So, and a lot of individual uh, terrific players that uh, should provide a very entertaining football game. So I don't know that you can ask for much more than that. It's going to be a fun one to watch, certainly. Now, final question for you to end kind of on a serious note. Do you know what dabbing is? What dabbing is? Yeah, well, I know what it is, but I can't do it. Now, I know where you're headed with this, and I've seen our coaches dab, and, you know, I can't dab like Dabo. I can't dab like Frank, so I just stay away from it. You don't want to try? Uh, how's that? <laughs> Is that close? That was close enough. It's the best I can do. <laughs> Thank you for, for your time so Great much, to and you, it's going to be a fun matchup tomorrow. It sure will be. Rebecca Fiorentino here, your guest reporter for the ACC Digital Network.